Over Diddy though. Get your money first, fuck the hater. Get your money first, get your weight up. Making money more, I ain't mad at you. Yeah, it's all about the clean and getting money. Get your money first, fuck the hater. What's good, everybody? Welcome back to Two Cent Tuesdays with Jenny, where you will be getting my unsolicited, unapologetic opinion about what's going on in the world today. If you are new to this channel, welcome. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and don't forget to hit that notification bell so that you are notified every single time that I post a new video. And you might as well go ahead and give this video a big old thumbs up. And without further ado, let's get right into today's video. P. Diddy recently had his 53rd birthday party, which was a small gathering with some of his closest friends, which happens to be some of the biggest celebrities, Jay-Z, Mary J. Blige, Jermaine Dupri, just to name a few. Um, and of course, his boo, Carisha, as we all know, Young Miami was in attendance as well. Now, we are all aware of Carisha and Diddy's relationship, you know, they started to appear in public together. Speculations was going on and it was like Carisha popped out with her own talk show on Diddy's Revolt TV. So he was her first interview and she was like, what we is, Poppy, we go together real bad. Um, but he was like not really claiming it. But as of lately, including at that party, there has been huge displays of affection between the two. Some serious PDA going on, smooching and the coochin. And he's been whining and dining her with all kind of gifts and all kind of things that we all wish we can have. Since Diddy's birthday, model Daphne Joy has now, who's also the mother to 50 Cent's son, one of his sons, she has been posting a lot of intimate posts at and Diddy. Um, she got him a personal cake that's like a little insider joke. Um, and she's feeling blessed as she posted a picture of the two of them together on her story. While Carisha is feeling just sprung so what is really going on here um clearly these two women have a very clear understanding of what they are to diddy and what their relationship is um and i guess as long as you got money it's all good which i think so my question to y'all is do y'all think that these two women are only okay with the situation because of diddy's wealth or they just love them some poppy so much that they don't care that they have to share him. What do y'all think in the comments down below? Is money enough for you to uh, be in a love triangle publicly with no shame? Again, let me know what y'all think in the comments down below. And I'm going to go ahead and drop my two cents in on the situation. I'm not going to front. Like, the whole Diddy, Carisha... Now this other woman is just always just like cringy to me. I don't know. It's just because it's Diddy. So it's just, I don't know. To me, it's cringy. But I, I always felt like, you know, Carisha ain't stupid. You know, she know what she doing. She's a city girl. They talk that shit. Like, <laughs> I'm going to get this money. I'm going to get these opportunities that this man is going to give me with. And if I got to give him a little hoo-hoo, on the side, then so be it. Um, however, I do feel like Carisha's feelings is a little bit deeper in it than she's leaning on. I could be wrong, because I don't know her. But, you know, it's the post, like, all the way. I, I just love the way he makes me feel, the kiss. Like, is your boyfriend and girlfriend? Or what is this? Um... I, 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 a part of me wants to say, obviously, because he got money is why he moving the way he moving and they okay with it. But at the same time, there's a lot of chicks out here that be knowing 
dude's situation. They be broke and still be messing with them because they just don't care. But I think because it's public, it's just like, wow, like no shame. Like y'all just completely okay with both of y'all posting this man as your, my boo-boo, my baby, my everything. And it's the people in the comments like, oh, he like, he like Carisha more because he gets her this and her lie. Not y'all comparing. Not y'all comparing who he like more. Child messy. But I do feel like money plays a big part in the situation. Like if he was some regular dude, like this shit would not be so smooth. Now I'm not saying there's not broke dudes out here doing what he doing. Cause they are. And some women are where like, okay, you, you mess with her, you mess with me. Like I know you got a girlfriend, but I still like you, so we're gonna do our thing anyway. And you borrowing my car and shit, you know. These things still happen in real life, but it ain't as smooth, I'm sure, as Diddy shit is right now. Like, it's giving real, like, it's okay, you can post, you can post, yeah, we good. But that don't really be happening like that in real life. You understand what I'm saying? But if you got somebody giving you the life of luxury, I mean, <laughs> post what you want to post. Do you, boo? Just make sure that check clears. I don't know. Like, I'm, it's just not for me. I've never been somebody who used men for money. I don't even like asking men for money, to be honest. I don't like asking anybody for money unless I'm like, really, you know. I don't, I just, I can't imagine, like, using a guy for money and the way some women just freely do it it's it's listen more power to you but i can't imagine putting myself in a situation this love triangle just because of money like it's one thing if you genuinely catch feelings which i feel like they have um Cause we all been there, done that. You know, you catch feelings, you can't help. But what the one thing you're not about to do is play with me, okay? You got another person out here posting you. I'm posting you. That's what we not about to do. I can't. Mm -mm. That's a no for me. But I guess they say it ain't tricking if you got it. He's Diddy. I mean, this is nothing new. Um. Actually, this is kind of new because I've always seen him in relationships. Relationship. He was with J-Lo. He was with Cassie. Like, he was with Kim. Granted, I'm sure he was cheating. But, like, he was with he was a one-man, one-woman man. But now, I feel like he getting older. And he just know he ain't going to settle down with nobody. And he like, oh, listen, I got money to do what the fuck I want to do and I'm going to do it. And these young ladies are going along for the ride. Interesting. Let me know what y'all think, please, in these comments down below. Is this just a new way of doing things? Would you do it? Would you be cool with it? Or is it no for you? <laughs> Let me know what you think in the comments down below. As always, thank you guys for watching. Make sure y'all follow me on all of my social medias. Everything will be in the description down below. And Jenny is out.